Blepharitis is an inflammation of the eyelids. Even after receiving treatment, blepharitis doesn't disappear completely. If anyone's ever suffered from blepharitis, you will know that it's quite painful. I have it in my left eye right now. It's extremely red. It is red compared to the right hand side. So I am taking some chloral phenicol eye drops that are antibacterial. Hopefully this will make a difference. And also to help with easing the pain and making the blepharitis go away, um, I use a mask. I heat it in the microwave for like about 10 seconds. And then I use a Q-tip to massage my eyelids, followed by some normal eye drops and blepharitis gel which is what I use to keep the eyelids coated and moisturized um, but this chlorum phenicol I'm supposed to be using it for a week the first 48 hours every two hours and then afterwards every four hours you don't include the time when you're asleep so hopefully all these measures will help ease the pain and make this blepharitis go away. Um, blepharitis means dry eye and it's when your eyelids are inflamed and it could get worse and it could lead to major headaches so it's best to get it treated. It has been 48 hours since I've started taking Chlorum phenicol, which is the antibacterial eye drops. So I phoned my surgery today and I managed to get an appointment for 3.20 this afternoon. The doctor will see me and hopefully I could get some resolution to this eye infection. I don't know whether this is blepharitis. It could be something different. But I think it's important to get it checked out because it is your eye and it is painful. And I think that there is, in my eye, I think there is some discharge coming out of the left eye. So I just want to make sure that it's under control and that it's not more serious than I thought. It's been a week since I started feeling some discomfort in my eye. It turns out that it's not blepharitis and that it is, in fact, an eye infection. So I need to continue using the chloramphenicol four times a day. And hopefully the redness and the irritation will go away. So maybe just two more days of treatment and then I should be fine again. Overnight, my eye condition worsened. I phoned 111 and the consultant advised me to go to the hospital immediately. Well, I have made it to the Western Eye Hospital outside Baker Street on Marlebone Street and I need to get my eye checked out. When I received the call back from the consultant, she said that it doesn't seem to be blepharitis or an eye infection and that it could be something more serious. So I've made it here and they close at 8.30. So let's see what happens. Well, I have just come out of the Western Eye Hospital. Um, what I have is marginal keratitis. It's a part of the blepharitis family. Um, so they say that it's not caused by bacteria, so it's sterile. They have prescribed me with steroids with an antibiotic mix to it. So hopefully that will help. We'll see. 
they prescribed me Cobra's X, which helped with my marginal keratitis, which is a form of blepharitis, which is the inflammation of your eyelids when the tear ducts become clogged and then that's what causes the pain and the redness. But this medication has helped and yes, I hope no one has to go through this because it is quite painful, especially not knowing what the cause of it is. So if you do have any issues with your eyes, it's best to go see your doctor and get some advice there.